वेलकम टू मेटल टूटोरियल फॉर बिगनर टू एडवांस कैश कोर्स 2020 पार्ट थ्री टू डे वी आर गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट मैट्रिक्स वी बिगेन दिस वीडियो विद मैट्रिक्स वी गो ऑन टू लुक ब्रीफली एट मैथमेटिकल ऑपरेशन एंड हाउ टू हाउ दीज ऑपरेशन कैन बी अप्लाइड इन आ वाइल्डली डिफरिंग एरियाज सो नाउ फॉर एप्लीकेशन वी आर गोइंग to our matlab command window so here now i we are in our matlab command window so first enter c is equal to 3 12 10 colon 17 eighteen 35 colon Seven, ten, twenty-four. Sorry, here we put seven and bracket close. Then press enter. Then enter. X is equal to four zero zero. Four zero zero colon six six zero colon zero three five and closing back to bracket then colon press enter. Then we type total is equal to c dot multiply x. Enter c and x as matrix from the command window line with a semicolon at the end of each row. Now. At the end of third command line, total is equal to c dot multiply x. Sum total return a vector where each element is the sum of each column of totals. So we can see here is twelve zero zero. because this is a multiply this is a multiplication operator so to find product sum e total sum total return a vector where each element is the sum of each column of total so now we check how to find transpose so first type First type C L C. Press Enter and clear the command window. Then we put C is equal to one colon three. Then semicolon four. Then colon. Then six and close bracket. Bracket. Press Enter. So you can see our C matrix is one, two, three, four, five, six. Now we are going to find transpose of a matrix C. So we put B is equal to C transpose. So press Enter. so no you can see b is the transport of c so transpose operator is this then the rows into column and vice versa now we are going to talk about the column colon operator is very powerful and provide for very efficient way of handling matrices so now we type C is equal to bracket. So we type C is equal to bracket one, three, two, two, six, 
semicolon then we type semicolon seven colon nine close bracket press enter so we can see our C matrices one two three four five six and seven eight nine so now we type C so now we type C small bracket two so now we type two column three comma one colon two and press enter so you can see return second and third row first and second column so this command returns second and third rows first and second columns so now we type c so now we type c three comma colon press enter so this return the third row now we can use another view of colon by typing by typing c small bracket two so now we type c small bracket one two two comma two two three small bracket close equal to once to press enter so you can see we change the values of c column by ones now we are going to learn duplicating row and columns in this command we are going to duplicate rows and columns so we type c is equal to one one colon three bracket close press enter you can see our c matrix is equal to one two three so now we type the command R E P. So now we type repeat matrix short R E P M A T and C comma bracket three space one and bracket close press enter. So you can see we can repeat the matrix by this command this statement produce are three by one of copies of C matrix now we are going to learn how to delete rows and columns we use this colon operator and the empty array to delete so we type C is equal to so we type C dash colon dash comma 2 is equal to input or press enter so we delete second column and third rows read the second column of c create how to create identity matrix by using command i so now we are going to create identity matrix by type e y e bracket 3 so press enter generate and 3 by 3 identity matrix i may be used to construct construct c triangular matrix so we type c is equal to 2 multiplied by press enter so you can see then type c press enter now press enter so you can see so you can see we can we construct our triangular matrix by using eye command so in matlab functions we have some special matrix and now we are generate uh, a pascal matrix of, of an order by typing so we can generate some special matrix in matlab by using these command a pascal matrix by typing P A S C A L C A L and four. So we can generate fourth order Pascal matrix type enter press enter and you can see this is the fourth order Pascal matrix. 
you can change the order by typing here the value of order so now we can generate magic matrix by typing so we can generate magic special magic matrix by typing magic five so this is for fifth order magic matrix press enter so you can see in matlab there are so many special matrix and special command for them at last at at, uh, at at the last of this video and now i am going to talk about manipulation of matrix by using flip we can manipulate matrix by typing by using flip command and type here we can flip the matrix c so we can rotate matrix by 90 degree or 180 degree so in this video at the end we i am use flip uh, using flip you can see we can manipulate the matrix now i am signing out by promising to meet to meet you again very soon with another video till then if you are watching on youtube please don't forget to hit like button and share my video with others thank you